Hey everyone, I'm Noah, an indie game developer. I'm currently making one game every single day and often joined by my brother Liam. Today I'm going solo though and as a continuation of the one game a day series, I'm bringing you along for the ride. I woke up to check some of the great comments you guys left on yesterday's video. I would make another video game based on one of these. So after a quick search, I stumbled upon Milo's suggestion on making a game where you try to reach the moon by climbing the stars. I began my project by creating the artwork for the player character and a fat golden star. I made some animations, some C-sharp programming, and soon I had a player bouncing up and down. I really wanted to nail the magic and wonder of space. So spent a considerable amount of my precious 24 hours on the background visuals, testing all kinds of shader effects using my favorite all-in-one shader asset pack from the Unity Asset Store. I've been wanting to try a specific game idea for quite some time, one where you control a character while simultaneously drag and dropping hazards, environment pieces, and monsters into the game world. So that's exactly why I did. The golden stars which help you reach your destination cause precious dust, while monsters give you dust, which means you're constantly balancing enemy and star placements. I mean it so sometimes you get a bunch of white stars that propel you a little less further in the air. This forces the player to adapt a bit more, which I really like. Since starting this challenge, I've been spending roughly 10 to 13 hours on the computer every single day. So despite having a crazy deadline to complete both the game and this video, I decided it was important to go stretch my legs and do some sports. And sure thing, I returned feeling pumped and ready for more hustling. I created the win state for when the player reaches the beautiful golden moon, and as always, worked hard on good sound effects and player feedback. <laughs> these text pop-ups explaining to the player that he spent or acquired dust, or even this nice golden death effect for the protagonist. I call the game Star Hop, feeling like this might be the most fun game I've made in the seven days of game development challenge. There's many ways I could expand on this project with more star types, enemies, and biomes. The mechanic of drag and dropping elements into a world just seems filled with potential. You guys can all play for free directly in your browser, and I'm super curious to know what you think of the project and whether or not I should spend an extra week or two expanding on it. You can also leave a comment with your own game idea and there's a chance I'll turn it into a video game and feature you in tomorrow's video. We want to remind you that if you also wanted to make your own games and perhaps one day create the next masterpiece, then a great place to start your journey would be our Udemy courses, which bring you through the entire game dev process, from coming up with an idea and making beautiful artwork, to programming and of course finishing a complete game using Unity. The links to all that is in the description, and with that said, stay tuned and see you tomorrow for another great day of game development. To the moon, my friends.